back to my channel. My name is Kelly, if you are new to my channel. I've really got to come up with a different um, intro. I feel like I'm always saying that same thing, even in like sit down um, videos, and I don't really like it. So I'm, I, I apologize if you don't like it either. I'm gonna start saying something new. Um, but I'm just heating up my coffee. Gosh, I don't even know what time it is. Um, but it has been a morning. Addie was up at like five this morning, no, 5.30. And so I put her in the bed with me and Caleb and then we finally got up around 6.30, but that girl was not sleeping from 5.30 to 6.30. So I fed her um, and we ended up going back down and laid back down till about 9.30. So that was such a blessing that we got to sleep in late. It was so, so nice. So Addie Mae, Adeline, she knows how to hold a bottle, but sometimes she gets lazy um, and she does not hold her own bottle. Um, if you guys are wondering, yes, I did get my hair dyed. It's a lot darker, I love it. As I'm feeding Addie Mae, I want to kind of talk to you guys about something that um, has been sort of weighing down on my heart. Um, some of you guys like to watch my day in the life videos um, and not watch my like little sit down videos. Um, I've recently filmed a what is important to me as a Christian mom slash Christian wife. And I mentioned something at the very end of the video. Um, if you have watched it till the very end, thank you so much. If you didn't, I kind of want to recap on what I talked about. Um, I talked about how I wish from the beginning of my YouTube, um, you know, little adventure with YouTube that I'm doing, my little time with YouTube that I wish that I would have taken, um, you know, being a Christian and sharing my Christian life more seriously. Um, as I'm getting older and as I am a mom and as I am a Christian wife, I know so many young Christians, maybe not married yet, um, or even have kids yet, but I know so many young Christians, maybe not personally, but through like social media and things. And it is such a huge community um, Christian ladies are. And I want to gear and like shift my channel to a more Christian based um, channel. Um, just have like a little community for like Christian women. And I don't know why I didn't do this in the first place. I feel like it was more of like a selfish thing. Um, you know, I kept it to just doing little personal videos that I wanted to do. Um, but I think it's really important that I share about God and share about God in my life. It's not working. What? You need to show the camera what you're doing. <laughs> 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 you're like, <laughs> 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 it smells like salt and vinegar chips. Okay, so it has been a few days. It is now Monday, I believe the 23rd. And the last I spoke to you guys was on Thursday. I don't even remember what date that was, but it was this past Thursday. And I'm pretty sure I ended up with food poisoning. It was awful. So, um, I'm back. It has been a few days. I finally feel up to it. Um, I am making us dinner. Caleb has CDO today, so I'm making us some pizzas. So, I'm just doing that. Um, Hazel and Adeline are watching some little baby bum. Hey, guys. Okay. <laughs> It is officially a week since I have um, started filming this vlog. I did not intend for this little vlog to be so spaced out um, or to kind of last this long. The Some kind of bug has hit my family. Um, by bug, I mean like a stomach bug. Little Hazel is thankfully still sleeping. Oh my goodness, it was so awful last night. She... Y'all yeah, just, it, it's just been awful. Um, but luckily, Addie is doing okay. She's right here in front of me. She's just playing this morning. Um, 
and Caleb's doing fine. I'm doing fine. It's just Hazel. But um, I have gotten some things from Target that I wanted to <laughs> show you guys. I went to Target a week ago today, um, the day that I started filming, and I actually wanted to kind of take you guys around Target with me, and I wanted to show you guys what I got from Target when I got home, but unfortunately, I started feeling bad, so I ended up not doing any of that, and I ended up having what I thought was food poisoning um, for like a couple days. Uh, I don't think it was food poisoning. I'm thinking I had the bug, and then Caleb got it, and now Hazel's got it, so... Who knows, but I want to show you guys some stuff that I got from Target. Okay, so I don't shop on Grove Collaborative and probably never will. Let's get what I need from wherever, Target, Walmart. Um, and the cheapest place for Method Cleaner is Target, believe it or not. Um, I looked at Walmart. Walmart is like, I can't remember if it's like around three or four, um, dollars more expensive than Target, which I can't believe that. And getting it off of Amazon is a joke. You can get this for like three dollars. It's like it's like three dollars and something, close to four, but it is cheaper at Target. So if you're ever looking for um method cleaner, go to Target. Um I got the wildflower scent and it looks like this. I've never tried this one. I also picked up the scent Citron. It looks like this. It's like a citrusy smell. It's sort of similar to the wildflower, but in like a citrusy type of way. And it smells so good. Recently, I have broke my O-Cedar mop. And I needed a new mop head. So I went there to get a just the mop and a mop head. Um, unfortunately, they didn't have the mop. They had the mop head, so I went ahead and picked this up. Cause I needed a new one and hopefully next time I go they'll have um, a mop <laughs> and the next thing that I want to show you guys is a three-tier utility cart and I have it right behind me you can see that so this is what it looks like excuse Addie Mae she is very very whiny so I got that three-tier Utility cart, don't mind the mess. Like I said, it has been a little crazy around here. Um, but this is what it looks like, and it was 16 bucks. Um, I am gonna use it for Hazel. I'm thinking about putting some of her toys in it and keeping them in the living room because we transport toys from the living room to our room so much. So I'm just gonna go ahead and keep some of her toys in here like some blocks that she likes to play with, um, maybe a doctor set, just so she has it on hand. <laughs> just going through all the emotions here right now she is just tooting and I'm pretty sure she's having teething poops so finally she'll she's almost nine months old so um it's I'm ready for the teething stage to begin um but I just went and checked on Hazel and she's still sleeping bless her heart hopefully she sleeps for a good few more hours um what time is it now? Like 8 something? Probably like around 8.30. I'll probably wake her up maybe around 12 or something. That girl, bless her heart, she honestly probably did not go to bed. Like actually start getting sleep until about 4 this morning. Uh, no ma'am. I think maybe that's the, her way of going through this little bug. Don't mind my hair. It's a crazy mess. Um, I just have on some comfortable clothes. Because today is going to be like major disinfecting day and laundry because we have so much laundry to do um every time that hazel got sick last night caleb was getting some kind of different sheets different pillowcases different bedding so it's going to be a crazy day today <coughs> Okay, guys, 
guys, I'm gonna go ahead and end the video here. It has just been a crazy morning, a crazy day. Um, and I will try to have this video up by 8 a.m. on Saturday. I've been kind of slacking. The only reason is because I have been sick and we just had other things going on. Just crazy. Um, so yes, I will have this video up by 8 o'clock on Saturday. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye guys.